know what I mean? I pray that my n really didn't feel no way. And if he did, my got my chin out. Take your best shot. I'm gonna take that shit on the chin, boy. Do what you do. No. <laughs> good like it's it's love true path because i ain't gonna lie to y'all past two days felt terrible like, <laughs> Except for one part. It's one part of that that make me feel like, man, that's the lamest shit I ever did in my life, right? Go! <laughs> I want to hear. I do not want to hear another J. Cole fan for the rest of my life. <laughs> <laughs> y'all heard some that happened two, two, three weeks ago, however long it was. Y'all heard that bazooka that was dropped on the motherfucking game, right? No, not him! Don't praise the project! <laughs> what are you doing? People think Kendrick Lamar is one of the greatest motherfuckers ever touch a fucking microphone. This man is apologizing! And if he did, my got my chin out. Take your best shot, I'm gonna take that chin. Bro. What the? <laughs> You opening it up for him to diss your back, Mike Jermaine. <laughs> I need all the J Cole fans, okay? Because all I saw, okay, I'm not even like J, J Cole. I'm not even here for you, bro. Okay, if you if you felt like that was messing with your spirit, hey man, I pray for your peace. Okay, it's ain't about you. I pro for me personally, it's not about you. I still respect you. It's not about. It's about your fans. <laughs> was spending the past couple of days crying. <laughs> Kendrick fans, Kendrick fans are ruining rap because, 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 because J. Cole sent a shot and y'all, and y'all saying it wasn't very good. Even though it was weak and we all knew it was weak and y'all niggas over here coping saying he was sending warning shots. He was sending warning shots. You gotta wait for the full course meal. You gotta wait for the dinner. You gotta wait for the finale. He was sending warning shots. You don't understand rap. You don't understand hip hop. J, J. Cole was sending warning shots. I never see so much cope. I saw grown ass men turn into basically Taylor Swift stands on the internet because they could not accept that J. Cole did indeed send a weak diss track back at Kendrick. Okay, he did, all right? All right, it is what, it, maybe he's just not that type of guy. Okay, and that's okay, that's okay, J. Cole. But at the same time, at the same time, I saw so much crying. It's so much copy. <laughs> Couldn't accept you out. Now, I do think it's kind of strange, J. Cole, that, this out of all the things was 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 kind of messing with you, all right? Because all you really said was that an album was kind of boring. <laughs> that's all he really said. I mean, he said more stuff, but that's really that's what people really remembered. But <laughs> apparently, that had him feeling conflicted and misusing his influence. <laughs> Bro, I'm still in my, I am in my drawers right now. I was over here, you know, watching the WWE, you know, WrestleMania and whatnot. Seeing somebody actually finish the story, Jermaine. Okay. <laughs> I come on Twitter, seeing this man apologize. In my opinion, neither of them really even felt that much like a diss track. <laughs> I think it's talking about hip hop is back. Hip hop is back. <laughs> And now I see all the, all the J. Cole fans looking foolish. <laughs> what J. Cole fans, let's come to terms. J. Cole's not on the same level as Kendrick, okay? 
let's 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 come to that let's come back to reality okay i remember what i even said literally two weeks ago what rapper gonna go y'all niggas said drink and i said j cole i'm sorry and after i said that all the j cole fans were coming at me crazy y'all were coming at me crazy look at the j cole fans your downfall is upon you no Is that pettiness for me? After what they said to me in that comment section? Yeah. I said that's top tier pettiness. He's gotta go, he does. And at this point, yeah, he does gotta go, okay? He is uh, indeed on the bottom. J. Cole out of the big three is Bleach, okay? And I know Bleach fans is like, why are we getting the straight? Because Bleach fans, you're on the bottom. Just like J. Cole out of the big three, you're on the bottom. I don't care what metric or measure you wanna go by, in every metric and measure, you are on the bottom of the big three. <laughs> Like I said, J. Cole, I'm not trying to make this about you, buddy. Okay, I still respect you so much. You're a rapping Hall of Fame legend. I'm not trying to come at you. But the J. Cole fans, though, the J. Cole, nah, -uh. J. Cole fans, you think you about to skate by right now? Nah, -uh. <laughs> nah, -uh. nah, -uh, nigga, nah. -uh. All of y'all are about to get this work right now for your cope. For right now. <laughs> Every J. Cole fan go into early hibernation. I mean, what J. Cole? J. Cole, you could have just talked privately with Kendrick and left it. I, why would you do this? Not even for you. Your fans, your fans are about to get so much work. Oh my gosh, I am never letting them live this down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he even said, hey, I'm gonna take it on the chin, okay? Come back at me, Kendrick. I'm sorry. I will humbly get knocked the fuck out for this apology. I don't know why J. Cole would say that. Okay, I do understand. I respect it. I respect the spiritual journey. I respect that I was messing with your peace. Certainly. But you're fans. <laughs> I'm not even really a big rap beef guy to begin with. I don't even really care that much. But you're fans. But the fans. The cope. The cope. <laughs> they will live with this forever. <laughs> and I love every single second of it. <laughs> Because they are realizing they are at the bottom. <laughs> ah! Jermaine. <laughs> Go. <laughs> I'm done.